complete Bay Area news coverage starts right now. This is KTBU Channel 2 News at 5. A Bay Area company has developed a new tool now being used for delicate, sometimes risky procedures. It's a computer-driven robot called a cyber knife, and it's changing the way doctors are approaching invasive surgery, even making them outpatient procedures. Our KTV Health and Science editor, John Fowler, has a look in tonight's special report. 69-year-old travel agent Judy Shablo says her symptoms came on suddenly while at home. Her husband called 911. I was not really conscious very much. I was pretty gone. Couldn't move my arms, couldn't move my legs. I was just awful. At Stanford Medical Center, doctors say it was a pea-sized tumor called an acoustic neuroma deep in her brain, seen here with a CT scan and MRI. We take both of those and fuse it, and that gives us the best image and the most accurate targeting of the acoustic neuroma. Conventional treatment is risky surgery. The tumor is next to hearing nerves. Drilling open the skull, working your way down to the tumor while avoiding these critical nerves. Surgery can last 10 hours, recovery months. But today, Judy, wearing a stabilizing mask, is being treated in just minutes by a computer-driven robot called a cyber knife, which shoots precise timed beams of radiation at the tumor. To uh, ablate it or, or destroy it, uh, and there is no hospitalization, there's no 10 hours of surgery, there's no downtime for the patient. They can leave the cyber knife and go golfing, go out to dinner. The cyber knife is developed by Accuray of Sunnyvale, where the company let us in to see its latest version. They have turned off the radiation. It's almost like an automobile assembly line robot. It gives the doctor remarkable flexibility and it tracks the motion of the patient, even breathing. So the accuracy of radiation to tumor is less than a millimeter. More precision to the tumor, uh, greater sparing of normal tissue around the tumor from the side effects of radiation. To treat Judy's tumor, doctors came up with a plan using 131 individual beams of radiation. They all coincide and target the tumor, which is on behind her right ear. That way, the full dose is delivered to the, the tumor and the rest of the brain is minimized. The $5 million machine is basically a small linear accelerator mounted on a robot arm. Judy had three half-hour cancer treatments. Some patients need only one. Her only complaint, she wanted Western, not classical music. I feel fine. I feel great. Yeah. Remember this uh, acoustic neuroma with the cybernetic radio surgery, our ability to kill the tumor and prevent it from growing is, is approximately 99%. And in five minutes, Judy was off to lunch. Health and Science Editor John Fowler, KTVU, Channel 2 News.